right, round three. Marsh, your turn. Both on seven card hands. Mine's a little sketchy though. Tap. Monk. To you. Let's see. Got, whenever you cast a second spell, we'll put a counter on. Okay. I feel like I've been keeping some sketchy hands today. Me too, man. So We're in it together. Tenacious underdog. Your turn. Tap. To read Draw? I'd love to read them. Yeah, cool. You can blitz it out from the graveyard. That's kind of yep. sick. Not that you necessarily need to here, but if you... So you blitz it, goes to the graveyard, blitz it back. Yep. That's kind of cool. Okay. And I will tap two. Play my Luminarch. Yep. Um, and I will throw a counter on that. You'll draw one off the top next turn. No, I won't. <laughs> He's clearly never played magic with me. <laughs> I was, you know, trying to be positive. All right, let's go. I wonder if the camera's picking up that they're power washing the sidewalk outside. They're not. Another one. I do the land though. See? I literally predicted that land. Oh, let's And it was see. a perfect land for you. Yeah, it gave me my third color. Let's third see. third and fourth play color. Play a corpse appraiser. So when it enters the battlefield, exile up to one target creature card. Yeah. I'll hit the Luminarch. And then if. Exile from the graveyard? Yeah. yeah. And if I do, I look at the top three, take one, put the other two in the graveyard. Okay. Cool card. Take that one, and I'm putting a Xander's Lounge and okay. Lord Xander in the graveyard. Cool, cool. All of you. Lord Xander is a lot of text. Yes, I'm familiar. Okay. Um, just uh, a little, a little light reading. It's like the Questing Beast. A little light reading. Just a little. All right, tap two. Fateful Absence. Yep. I think I have a clue token. Nice. I'll tap two more. Put it on my sun gold. And I'll boot one of the blitzes. Up to one target tree. Yeah, cool. And then. Uh, so, second spell. Yep. So that triggers my spirit token. Bust that out. And then um, I'm going to swing in with that bad boy. For two, right? Damage has been done. First blood has been drawn. Good start. I'm cast Tainted Indulgence. Draw two, then discard a card unless you have five or more mana values among cards in my graveyard. So I have a zero, a two, a three, and a six. Okay. So I'm going to draw two and discard. So it's, uh, I can tap two and make it um, like protection from a certain okay. color um, if I have three creatures with different abilities. 
So I have first strike, flurry of blows, flying, and whatever this does. So I guess the the three different abilities was the only part of this that I didn't understand. The three powers. Three powers. Three powers. Yeah, three different powers. Power. Their power. One, two, one. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Power and toughness. That's what that's yeah. referring to. Yep. Okay, so pay two, choose a color, gain sex from that color, and can't be blocked by colors of that creatures of that color. Okay. But I don't. Oh, I do. I have three. You do I have, have three, three different powers. Yep. So there you go. I can do it. All right. All set. All set. He. Yeah. Oh yeah. He's that tapped. was tapped. Yeah. You could leave it untapped. <laughs> I don't know that it makes a difference here. Not particularly. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, two lands. Dang. I'll give you a hint. Yeah, yeah. There was another land in there. Um, that spicy mana base, dude. It's true. <laughs> okay. I will. S- I think I can activate this. You can. My three. Yep. My three. One, two, three. You can make and, that. Uh, so I'll make it unblockable. Swing into that. That's a lot of that. Um, I don't have a second spell or anything. Three. Okay. Uh, can't block them, so take four. Yeah, I'm gonna do. It'll be a different. End step, I'll Sounds good. Is that on your end step? On your end step. Yep, maybe I'm on my end step. Go to my turn. I'm never gonna activate the second. <laughs> I, I the second spell, not yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> not now. Yeah. <laughs> uh, soul shatter. You sacrifice a creature or planeswalker with the highest CMC. Okay. Uh, sorry, Thalia. Yeah. You paid four for her. Or? I did. Yeah, yep. good stuff. Four there. Uh, I'll play a land. And a graveyard trespasser. Okay. And it becomes a daytime. I'm gonna forget about this. I'll try and remember. Yeah. <laughs> um, pass. Okay. Hold that. Draw for turn. Tap two. Clarion Spirit. Mm-hmm. Um. So if I play nothing, that goes to night. So yeah. I play my one. So that's yeah. good. Um. In the air. Six. No flip. Go. Mm. Okay. I got choices now. Spells can't be countered, and instants and sorceries make greater have flashback. Nice. And I'm gonna flashback the Blood Chief's Thirst on that Clarion Spirit. That's badass. Just giving everything flashback for its literal cost is hardcore. Because normally things have flashbacks plus. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and I'll attack with the 3 3. 
Okay, I'll take the three. Then go to 17. And then pass. Untap and draw. Cool. Tap one. Paladin class. Gotta read this one. Oh man, creatures get one plus one plus one. Spells during your turn. Yeah. So I shall um, level it up to level two. So tap three, and we put this on to level two. So everybody has plus one plus one. Um, so I got a two, three, uh, three, four, three, four, three. three. never going to really be able to take advantage of my cards. <laughs> to you. Maybe, maybe the time counter will get me there, the flyer, my little token. <laughs> I got to start killing your creatures. No. Yeah. Fuck that, dude. Yeah. You don't need to kill creatures. This is an aggro deck. <laughs> Rick me who hooked me in every single game. I haven't found mine yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to Maestro's Charm you. Okay. Uh, so it's the second mode is each opponent loses three life and you gain three life. Okay. So that's what I'll choose. So I go to 14 and you go to 7. Much more comfortable at 7. Sure. Yeah. Three creatures, and then each one should get plus three plus three. And yeah, side, you're getting way ahead of yourself. Is that? Uh, you, that was with. If you didn't interrupt <laughs> me, no, no, no. You're yeah, good. Yeah. You're good. You're yeah. good. I'm. I'm just making sure I'm interpreting. You are three interpreting correctly. that correctly. Yes. Perfect. That, that. I mean, I'm still a little new. Yeah. So I wanted to make sure at least I was thinking about that correctly. So I'll go to level three. Okay. So I'm. Um. You can move to your attacks. Are you gonna do something before I do that? Yes. So we're in combat. Beginning combat. Um. I haven't attacked with anybody yet, but right. well, well, there's a the beginning of combat doing. phase. Um, this is pre-combat, I, I guess. We're not in your main phase. Okay. We're at the beginning of combat. Fair enough. Um, Hit me with what you got. Because if I stop you in your main phase, then you can continue casting spells. I hear what you're saying. I see what you're doing, and um, I, I see what you're doing. You're good. Who are you taking out before we advance? Uh, the spirit. Okay. That too. Go to five. And then I will cast the Soul Shatter. So you sacrifice the one with the highest. So they're the same you choose. How'd you cast the Soul Shatter? For my graveyard with Lear. Three for the Soul Shatter, two for the... Your the opponents person. cast during your turn. Oh, I forgot, more about, more I forgot about that. So okay, I don't I forgot think about that that's part. legit. And I don't think that was fully legit either. No, it wasn't. I forgot about that part. So I have to pay three for that. Yeah. Come back, token. Come well, back. no, it's, I, I can cast it. You can cast it, but... Yeah. Okay, cool, you just cast yeah. it. All right, I good. can't cast both. Great. Uh, okay. I don't have mana to cast the others. Done? So, yeah. Yep. Okie dokie. So we have a 3-3. Three, three. Uh, three, 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 three. So when I attack, I get each one gets... Yeah, so I should have cast them all on my turn. Um, damn it. So that was a great play because it did uh, di disorient the, the buff I was hoping to give everybody. Um, I am notorious for leaning forward and hitting the kind of button. I don't think I have the wide open attack that I thought I had once before. So sorry for the delay. I'm just. Fuck, man. All right. 
to you. Okay. I don't like it. <laughs> uh, so this is flipped. This is flipped. Yep. And I totally forgot about his ATB and attack trigger. Yeah, so at this point, it's just Soul Shatter. Right. Cast that. You're going to pay like, an extra? I don't, not on your turn. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good, you're good, good. Each opponent sacrifices a creature. Okay. I'll take away the monk. Then I will cast the Maestro's Charm. So this, the other mode is 5 damage to target creature. Point. Cool. And then I will attack. And he has an attack trigger, so whenever it enters or tra attacks, exile up to two target creatures, and for each creature exiled this way, if they lose one, you gain one. So whatever, two. So you lose two off that. Okay. I gain two, so 7, 12. cast an expressive iteration with the top three one in hand one in exile one in library you can play the exile okay Two, bring out my Luminarch, um, go to combat, throw it on there, mm -hmm. and uh, do nothing about it to you, my friend. I don't think I can survive. Scoop. Okay, game two. Yep. I just had to look for, up for a second. <laughs> Yeah, the, I guess I didn't have a removal spell in my graveyard, but I have two other spells I can cast. Just being able to flashback stuff out of the graveyard was the, the game changer, yeah. because then you were able to pick out every single time. Yeah. Always and like, I, I totally forgot the You basically the operate like one. you have 20 cards in your hand when you have yeah. flashback on every single thing in your graveyard. So, yeah, great stuff. Yeah, and I forgot about the chapter or level one on that. I should have just cast all three of those spells on my turn. Yeah. Somewhere. I was off to a great start, man. Come on, I gotta rough, rough up my great start. <laughs> Nothing's better than playing it. Nothing's better than playing it against real people. So, there you go. As opposed to on Arena when it's fake people. No, it's just, <laughs> it's, it's, in Arena you get, you get a humongous wide swath of different types of players. You can get a guy that's like you, yeah. and we're going to be in a real game, or, or a game I could get whooped at, or somebody that's just like brand spanking, and you just steamroll them in four turns, think that you're a freaking god. In, in the, uh... The metagame is totally like, if you're playing a specific deck, they will pair you against specific decks. You think? Oh, absolutely. I, I actually wasn't sure that that was the case, but I feel like I get paired up a lot against the same old, same old. Yep. I think they actually I see a lot of green winning, <laughs> and I play a lot that. of red. So I don't know if they specifically they're green white at me, but it feels like that. I don't know, man. I feel like I play everything though when I play arena. You see a lot of everything. People get people get creative. There was one day I so played. So far, Rick has the most creative deck I've seen. And uh, if anybody sees Rick's deck, it's the most creative. It's he doesn't have a single fucking basic land of thing, and I love it. Yeah, there's a day on Arena where I played like five matches, and I'm pretty sure three in a row were against the same deck. Not the same player, though, but same the same deck. deck. So, yeah. yeah, and that's frustrating. You have a pro shuffle. Nah. You do. Um, it's not like fully perfect, but I mean, 
I like doing this. I don't even do yeah. a pro shot. I do a, an attempt. <laughs> Pretty sure this is stacked. I'm gonna give it one more. Oh, always, I always Christ. shuffle just so that we know it's a fair game of magic. As it should be. And like, sure, I don't think anyone here is cheating, but I'm still gonna shuffle everyone's deck so that I'm not being like judgmental one way yeah, or the other. I like, like I shuffle their deck because I think they cheat. It's a good. That's standard. not the message to. It's just thick as shit when it's yeah. double sleeved. Yep. All right, uh, I'm gonna go first. Yep. Do are we keeps? Yeah, I'll keep. Sorry. Yeah, we're good. You don't have to. You no, no, we're good. It's right. it's a questionable, but. Okie dokie. Moving on mm -hmm. into the game. Good luck, sir. That <laughs> Out of order, huh? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Thanks, dog. <laughs> Tap one. Yeah. Monk of the Open Hand. Oh, no, hand. That, that wouldn't have mattered. Wouldn't it? Second spell? Oh, the second spell, yeah, yeah. I was thinking because it was going to be a non-creature. It was the second spell, so if itself is the second spell, does it No, because it has to be in play for it to see that. Okay. So, yeah, you do want to cast that first, then. Yeah, there yeah. you go. So, hey, thanks for being a good guy. I was thinking you were trying to cast, like, another one of those, to you. and then it was, like, two more. Razor is legit, man, as it should be. I really like it. it uh, three color, like, you'd hope it's good. Mm. Love that up. Mm -hmm. So that's the plus one, plus one, right? Yep. So I got my three, three, uh, three, two, and first strike. So let's do it. That's a three, three? Yep. I'll attempt to block there. Okay. Um, let's trade. Okay. And then we'll take three. Yep. 17. Yep, all set. I give you a nod, but not a verbal. So. Yeah. <laughs> so try to make sure that this ever. Do you have any basic lands? Three. Nice. <laughs> no, was, hey, it's good. More than Rick. Let's upgrade <laughs> that. Okay. And one extra. And I'll pass. Okay. And untap. Draw for turn. Yeah, I'm never comfortable with like no basics. So I was around one of each color just in case someone field of ruins me or something. Land for turn. I finally got my cave. I've, I I put these in today and I haven't seen them yet tonight, so I'm excited about that. That enters tapped, right? Sure. Yep. Not doing nothing. And Thalia. Mm -hmm. To you. How greedy could you be? <laughs> okay. Untap. Draw for turn. Well, I missed a land drop because, of course, I've been two lands to take a removal spell. But. Okay. So. Land for turn. Tap five. Yep. You can cross your hand. Three, four, white dragon flying until end of turn. Still land. Plus one, plus one. Take four. 
Good luck. Expressive iteration. Two and I have a zero, two, three. So I have to discard one. Discard yeah, like, tenacious one. Um, your turn. Okay. Untap draw. I guess I, I play this and then I can't do the next thing. Well, no, I think I can. Okay, so this is kind of cool. So I'll tap two, play my spirit. Mm. Tap five. Um, I'll res no, oh, yep, sorry. you're good, you're good. You want to respond? I, no, I can't because that makes it cost more. Yep. You're good. Tap five, and yep. I'm going to go to level three. Oh, sure. Because um, if I, I mean, I tap this, so if I tap it for playing, like to create it, I can't attack with it. So go to combat, put a one on it. Mm hmm. And that's you. So that's a 3-3, three, three, correct? Not yet. Um, whenever I attack, I well, put a 1-1. Well, because it's boosted by that, and it's got a counter, right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Sorry, it is boosted from level 2, and then it doesn't get the additional counter until later. Right. And this is... So target I... attacking is for each other attacking, and gains double strike. Okay, so it gives it double strike. Which I probably should have considered last game. <laughs> So I think I was there, but I didn't quite attack at the end. But he, he blew up my border at the end. Expressive when I was iteration. Doing. So it is what yeah, it is. Is that your? Uh, no, it's not the mountain. That's the island. Do you have to pay more than that? Not on my turn. Never gonna hit him. I mean, I, I don't have a way to <laughs> no, you're do it on your turn <laughs> with a 4-5 um, double strike dragon. <laughs> like, that's gonna be a problem. That's true. Getting it to level 3 helped. Unless you're baiting me to attack, and then you're like, talk to the attacking creature, get the fuck! <laughs> Sorry, you two. Losing my guy. that out. Yes. Play a corpse appraiser. Look okay. at the aspirin. I had like, I have to find a removal spell for that. Yeah, no, I hear that. It's gonna just keep climbing, and there's other kind of climbers that are gonna climb and climb. Blood Chief's Thirsty Sanders Lounge. Okay. Um, pass. On tap. And draw. That's a great card. Tap three. Maybe. Do I want to? Yeah, let's do it. Tap three. Elite Spellbinder. Can I see your hand?
See you later, bubs. I'll deal with the obnix. Spell, spellbinder text. Obnix is, re, re, you know, a problem, but, you know, deal with the real last problem, which is you pulling everything out of your graveyard. <laughs> um, can't turn it into a cave dragon, so send you. Yeah. I don't have you need something. I might not have anything else. No, I know I can get an opposite right away. So I'm gonna fuck it. It's a four two right now. Yep. I'll take. Yeah. Okay, I'll take three. Yes, so it's better. The trespasser, hit the okay. spellbinder. Remember, you can always with, do worse. With yep. the enter the battlefield trigger that I remember about this time. Yeah, always be so worse. I gain one, you lose one. Okay. Uh, and it becomes daytime. And I'll pass. Okay. People are gonna love my my mana um, management. Well, that's one card. Gave it up. Swing it in. It's eight total. Eight total. Go for it. Trigger here, hit both thalias, I guess. Sure. And I gain two, you lose two. Straight target creature, you lose two life. Okay. And there's that. Good I card. believe that's game. Yeah, that's no. game. Dude, why you gotta have like a one <laughs> cheap ass instant at the end, man? Not to be salty, but that was something. But you I drew a lot of cards. You drew a lot of yeah. cards. So and, and, yeah. I'm I not, did make yeah. them. I don't know if it. I wanted been. to. I was thinking about this. Isn't uh, this isn't even a terrible card at late game. Oh yeah. But then I just had to swing in. I just had to swing in. Yeah. Because I had double. Early I had this on, level up. That's early on, I only had one removal really spell, and that first corpse appraiser was that. Yeah. And I was like, I I needed another land drop, no, and I didn't find it for three more turns. But I also needed removal spells to keep it. Yeah, you're dirty. Good games. Great games.